A burrito was a delicious meal wrapped in a tortilla, but for one NYPD officer, it turned out to be a mouse wrapped in a nightmare. So I order a grande steak, I get back to my car, take a big bite and crunch. That's when I see it, a dead mouse. A dead mouse that Frank O'Sullivan, the president of the Patrolman's Union says, was put there on purpose. This was an act of political violence organized by a group of radical anti-cop Antifa anarchists working out of the burrito haven. This is bogus. The officer called in a to-go order under the name Tom. The restaurant had no idea he was a cop when they made the food or packed the bag. So clearly, he wasn't targeted for being a police officer. I've always wanted to try mouse meat. I hear it's really tasty. From who? The union made it up as a power move. O'Sullivan wants me to issue a statement of public support for the officer to give them all extra hazard pay and to wear this never forget burrito ribbon. Weird. It's the exact same color as my colorblind awareness ribbon. No, it isn't. I won't give in to any of their demands. The union is powerful, but I'm sure that most of our uniformed officers understand this incident is nonsense. It is, as Peralta would say, no big whoop. Oh, I appreciate the shout out, sir, but I actually don't pronounce the H in whoop. Sir, all the uniformed officers just left. They're staging a walkout. Well, it seems I was wrong. So whoop is big after all. It, it is. Again, though, there's, there's no H in whoop. It, it's silent. Whoop. 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 Am I crazy? How do you say it? Say whoop.